Alright everyone, what is going on and welcome back to today's video. In today's video we are back with episode number 17, yeah 17, of the Outer Worlds playthrough. We are here right where we left off once again, no more additional stuff. Seems that we've been keeping it inside the city of Stella Bay, I don't feel the need to do any off camera work at the moment. Currently our goal is to speak to Braxton because that leads us into this quest. Um, obviously getting him back and then that quest also leads to get gaining Velvman's trust enough to get Grimm's Tossball poster. Once we do that we have to meet with Catherine and there is a Bolt 52 quest in Stella Bay that we can also look at. Um, Fallbrook which is on Monarch but we haven't been there yet so that means we don't really need the Vicar just yet. And um, yeah so pretty much we'll go ahead and get into the outer areas of this at some stage this episode. I'd say these first few quests take about 10 minutes of the episode I estimate something like that maybe a little bit less maybe a little bit longer I really don't know but either way we got a little bit of side stuff to do left in Stella Bay we ended the episode 15 with it all of episode 16 was it and we should finalize it here and then we can get a move on to areas such as Fallbrook, Devil's Bay except areas like that Devil's Peak so all stuff we can do for new quests and that will be our goal in the future but for now we will get this done which is to talk to Braxton he's in this apartment up here so that said that's all I really have to say thank you guys for checking this video out if you guys did enjoy it please do make sure you leave a like drop us up the notification bell also make sure to come check out my twitch stream links description down below I'd love to see you guys there with that said that's all I have to say thank you guys for checking this one out um, a like really does help this video go far so? also alongside the fact that a uh, come and check out my twitch stream I play all sorts of games over there if you'd like to check that out subbing with the notification bell helps you stay up to date with the everyday videos we upload here and yeah that's all I need to say let's go in here and uh, Laura's in here for some reason um, but not Braxton you again you've really got to stop doing that look at Braxton Braxton I've never even heard of a Braxton got nothing for you sorry no one's in trouble, I'm just looking to have a friendly chat with him. Oh. In that case, he told me he was delivering to this house in the ruins south of town. Whole family had fallen sick and he had some meds on hand. So maybe look for him there? Um, that's all. Alright, uh, looks like we're going out of town, uh, judging by that statement. Um, which means I want to keep it in town first. So we will go ahead and is Catherine in town? No, she's not. Is this one in town? This one is. Okay, we'll go check out this one then. No, sorry. Hold on. That one's telling me to go that way. So none of these other ones are in town. Is that what you're telling me? Essentially, I think that is what it's trying to refer to. This is a Did door out of town. In Bay? I had a fling or two, sure, but on Monarch. All right, well, it, that's that's all we have. So there's ruins south, and then there's ruins east maybe uh, that's why the two doors separate um yeah we'll go to this one first I suppose we'll see what's out here uh, and then yeah we got some exploring to do essentially so we ended up leaving earlier than expected I thought I'd do a couple of quests but all of them are taking me out so yeah we're out we are we're here to move on now and that's good so yeah Plenty of quests to do, plenty more to progress in terms of this Outer Worlds playthrough. Whatever game we end up playing in, in the alternative, I record all of these like in, in one or two days generally depending on what I'm doing. So I'm not really sure, I still haven't recorded the the new game yet. Um, I'm honestly thinking if no one suggests it, I'll definitely be taking Resident Evil 7 as the playthrough. She needs to talk hey, to me, so I'll shut up. Ask you. What's going on? Figure while we're out here in the wilderness anyhow, we might stop in on an old friend of mine. Preferably before we get to Hiram's. It's on the way, don't worry. You don't seem the type to run off and get yourself killed, and I could use the help. I definitely don't plan on getting myself killed. <laughs> well, we'll see about that. I'll be up front with you. I hate asking for help. I hate it. Every time I give someone the opportunity to disappoint me, they seem to make it their most immediate goal. But this, what I'm thinking, it's dangerous. Um, I'm honored you're asking and I'm thrilled to accept. What can I do? Really? Here I was stealing myself for inevitable rejection. I used to run with a band of hunters. Friends. Six of us. We were on Monarch when the corporations pulled out and we helped a lot of people pick up the pieces. I haven't seen two of them in years and the rest I know to be dead. I'd like to gather their effects and bury them all in the same places with the family we once were. What do you need to do? First, we go to Hayes. I'd buried him a ways from our encampment. 
I need to pay my respects. I'll show you where he rests. He had a medallion in his effects. That's what I'll bring home to Barry. Um, and after that? Then we find my two lost trackers and bring them home. A long time ago, we built an encampment in one of Monarch's cave systems. Trouble is, a mana queen showed up and kicked us all out. If we can find Rebecca and Anders, they'll know how to lure her out. Then, we kill the bitch and bury everyone's medallions together. Um, sounds fun. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Cap. Alright, we only have one companion left. I was just thinking of that in... Alright. The house is 200 meters away, not far. That is 500 meters away. Uh, meet with Catherine, that was 800 one, yep. And this is also 200 meters away, okay. So that was on the, the way to the main quest, so the main quest must be a distance away, yeah. Um, well, the closest one is this 200 meter one, so we'll stop in there first. Obviously, look around while we do it, Good though. Stellar Bay, only place on the planet that don't stink of sulfur. Right, here's the road. Follow it south. Um, I think we'll stick to this for now. This weapon should still do. Maybe it doesn't. I don't know. I mean, yeah, it does the job. It's hurting my uh, companions, though, that's for sure. Stay the hell away from me, me. That dude just absolutely launched at me. I give him that. Suffering too many corrosive burns has made you weak against corrosive damage. Uh, look, I don't think I take that too much, but I've already done my my three. So really, I should not... For a perk point, I don't think I should be accepting these negative effects. I don't think they're worth it. That's probably one I should have taken, though. That drug one was like the worst one I could have picked. I didn't know how many I'd end up getting in the end, though. So that's why I kind of just jumped at it. Uh, but that literally is the worst one I could have taken, so... Not good. But not much I can do about it now. I don't think I can revert them. Maybe you can, but... As far as I'm aware, you can't. I may be wrong, though. I kind of want to use a assault rifle next time I see an enemy, just to see how good it is. Because this damage is very high. I'm just not sure what its fire rate is. Like, I don't know what I'm working with here. If it's a full-on assault rifle with that type of damage, I expect it to shred. Yeah, honestly, that is a pretty damn good weapon. I I can't, like, that's pretty damn good. <laughs> so the only corrosive damage I'll be taking is from these, what are they, Raptodons? Seems to be the only time corrosive damage will be causing problems. Um, now that we're out, I'm not going back in just after doing these quests. I will, like, continue to look around for the rest. Like, try and do as many quests as possible. That's what I'm trying to say. I don't know. Careful. Only thing to <laughs> Wonderful. I'll take the XP. Thank you very much. Um, looks like this is our. No, that's not our way in. Okay. What are we looking for here? The other building's not this exact building, as far as I'm aware. I mean, let's check. Uh, what was the other quest, this one? Yeah, I didn't think so. It's like behind me somewhere. Yeah. Uh, well, we will get to that one after we get to this one. Let's go on in. This is gonna be, uh, this feels like it's an unnecessary loading screen just to get into a building. Like, no, this building doesn't seem big either. So, and it's no different to any of the other buildings, so why isn't it just rendered as an exterior? Unless it's got some sort of underground dam. Um, Visitor? Yeah, I don't know. What an unexpected surprise! Please come in, come in. I'm getting real bad fight or flight right now. Watch your step. People ain't this friendly outside city walls. The Edgewater deserters were perfectly nice, and they lived outside the city walls. Well, maybe not Adelaide, but everyone else. That's the spirit. Now come in, make yourselves comfortable. I'm looking for a man named Braxton, he supposedly came by here. I'm afraid we don't get many visitors out here. The Raptodons and Marauders scare off all but the boldest. And if you've braved them, you must be exhausted. Why don't you stay for dinner? 
Um, are you sure you haven't seen Braxton? I heard he was delivering medicine to you. I'm sure I would remember something like that. Now, quit fretting yourself about that. Make yourself at home. Dinner's almost ready. Something ain't right about this. Oh, hello there. Sorry, I'm not real good with, uh, names. It just gets hard to remember things. I recall moments, feelings, but the details slip. I felt like that after my dad passed. Walked around in a haze for weeks. I'm sorry you're feeling that way too. Other times it's like there's fog. I... Sorry, have we talked about this before? That's nice of you. I usually feel better after I eat. Mama said dinner's almost ready, huh? Well, I mean, I might as well keep asking questions. Let's talk to the mother. What a pleasant surprise. And just when I was beginning to fear we'd seen the last of good company for a spell. Yet the Eternal provides, does it not? If you say you have a company, why live all the way out here? I mean, if you're not gonna... And who could? Stretch out your hand and cosmic divinity reaches back. Open wide your mouth and the universe provides sustenance. Just that your presence here is a gift to us and one that we don't take for granted. Look at me, prattling on as if this gravy is going to cook itself. Why don't you run along until we are ready for dinner? Am I meant to come back then? Let's... You must be famished. Is it sticking again? I'm afraid nothing out here works the way it used to. There's a bit of a trick to jimmying it open. Yeah, I want out of here. Please, there's no need for incivility. Though I certainly understand how hunger sharpens the temper. I promise I'll get the door open once we've had our meal. Until then, why don't you stretch your legs a bit? Yeah, well, I'm gonna have to shoot these people eventually, so... I haven't taken my weapons, so... Are these the cannibals they were talking about? I think it is. Hey! What are you doing in my room? Um, if you don't want people going through your stuff, sorry, I was just looking Liar! Around. You're trying to steal the last of my rocket candies, aren't you? Sorry, champ. Space, there's choice pills, they cure all your ills. can pick it. Let's pick it. This is interesting. Yep. Oh no. No, 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 no. They sulfur sodden asshole. Ain't enough that the raps eat everyone. Now people are doing it too. Escape the house. Here we go. Alright, there may be a cut somewhere in there. Um, once you go down here, they're obviously waiting. Um, unfortunately... They are absolute tanks, and we're locked in a room with them, so I can't, I don't really know how to approach this, to be completely honest. This is my best melee weapon, if I'm not mistaken. Maybe melee is the way, I'm not sure. Maybe I can talk my way out of it, I haven't even okay. tried this. Uh. Now there's an intriguing prospect. Forgo the promise of a fine dinner now for others down the road. Martha, my dear, what do you say? It seems the eternal shall pro And there we have it. Alright, I... That's cool, but I'm still gonna kill these people. Um, <laughs> I'm not letting cannibals just walk free. Come on now. Let's get out my assault rifle. Go for the mother. She's the one with the gun. The melee guys you can kind of deal with. Come on, man, get these psychos away from me. 
Alright, his head just got popped off. Sorry, right, champ, that's not how this works. You don't just get to surrender. Yes, they did. I just had to, uh, use reasoning to get out of getting assaulted by all four of them so I could jump one of them. One of them to, uh... Hey, did she? I was gonna say, she must have got finished by one of them. Don't know who did it, but thank you. To you. Alright, yeah, they definitely did not deserve to live. <laughs> what a fucked up side area. You could tell, though. Um, you, uh, you could kind of tell. I wouldn't say you could fully tell, you can't tell. Um, it was definitely something off about the place though, and the and the voice acting and the setup was definitely leaning towards that, I think. Um, you just had to kind of find confirmation, I suppose, and that's what that locked room was. Good thing I have good lock picking, otherwise I have no idea how I would have found that out. I probably would have been trapped in there for a lot longer, but anyway, that's that done. So that leads to two quest completions over there. Uh, that is not the quest I was thinking of. That is the quest I was thinking of. Let's go check this place out now. I'm pretty sure it's just a big building that I have to clear. Yeah, as you can see, that is definitely no small area. I'd say right about here is probably when I stop talking about anything important. Um, yeah, I think that's... Yeah, I just died, as you can probably tell. I'm pulling out the assault rifle for this one once again, because for whatever reason, the ranged attack... I killed the Colossus fine, but his, his little variants... Their ranged attack just literally ended me. I don't even... Little guy's gotta go. No other way to put it. Look, they're just instant killing. It's fucked. What is this damage output that I'm having to deal with here? It's not very balanced at all, in my opinion. But with that said, uh, maybe that's what happened. Maybe I got blown up heavily. That would make sense. Because the damage that I just took was like absurd for corrosive balls. I didn't get meleeed, it was purely from the the spit. That's the wrong button. The wrong button so. I mean he did this instant killer, so I guess it's possible. I can say I should survive that. I was confident. I don't know if I should be picking this Raptor on meet up, bro. I really don't. Um, either way, if that's what's... Yeah, I, I'm struggling to keep up with this area, even though I feel like I have, I am well equipped. Like, I've got the laser gun, I've got this very high level assault rifle. Yet I'm still getting walked over by 99% of the enemies I'm encountering, so that's great. I'm gonna make sure I hit headshots with these. Get that critical splash damage in, and we're definitely doing better than if I was just hitting them in the face. Two mag locks, I'm alright with that. Oh, you meant to destroy these things? Meant to delete. Okay, gotcha. Light ammo. Uh, that was the. Was that the optional quest? Just the one. Uh, I thought there was more. Fair enough. There's two adrenos. I'll take that. What is up here? Another pickable. I mean, we've, we've stockpiled a bit of maglocks. 115 bits. I don't see a problem with that. Uh, I don't know about picking those. It's a pretty small area to be using. I didn't mean to pick that up. Maybe it's worth it. I don't know. There's money everywhere here. Don't know why. There's 31 more. There's 51 more. I'm not complaining. Oh, hello. Hello. hello? I hear boots out there. Wait, can I ask for boots? Um, hello, who's in there?
Um, well, I need to get into that room. Seeing as you're trapped, you might as well answer a few. There must be a way to open it from the inside. What do you mean? It's locked. Um, right, but okay, let's try the handle. Turn it upward then. Wait, upward? Oh my eternal soul, it worked! <laughs> ah, phew. Thank you so much. It was getting all stuffy in there, and I was getting a mite lightheaded, and I think maybe I was going to die. Now I'm out here, and I'm headed back to Amber Heights. Still landing yourself in trouble, eh, Hux? Oh, hi, Nyoka. Um, you mind getting me an escort back home? I'm... Oh, you're traveling with someone. Never mind. Sure you're okay? Oh, sure. I'm a runner. I'm used to getting all dizzy and... <laughs> hey, who's your identical, slightly blurry friend? Uh, normally when you help someone, they give you something for... Yeah, yeah, just be it. Good luck. With the trouble you cause me, that's... Why would you Thanks attack this useless individual? Um, okay. An axe. Don't think I need that. I'll take a flamethrower though. Don't know where that spawned in from. Thank you. Well, I found two mag locks, so maybe I could go pick that thing back there. I'm not really too... Yeah, I can't look up. It's, it's a small crate, which means it's probably nothing immensely valuable, I suppose. Uh, let's see what's over here. A workbench, a mag lock, uh, knock you out bar, I don't even know what they are. Don't really need that right now, some set of current weapons I'm using are equipped. Actually, are they? I have no idea. Uh, sleep. Does sleeping actually benefit you anyway in this game? I have no idea. Pick cartridge, toss full card, maybe someone will be interested in that, I don't know. Oh, someone's alive. Yeah, you hit him with that. If you spray, it gives you more opportunity to stun lock them with the head shots. So I think in the end that is a smarter idea. This is a reasonably big area, I'd like to say. Um, we're not going back there yet, though. Um, both of them are return quests. We will... Where, how far away is this one? 600 meters. Let's look at the map. Yeah, we'll go there next. Let's make our way over there then, I suppose. I I don't know what to expect in the open world, so whether ex exploration comes in or not really just depends on what I say, for one. And is this the dead guy they were talking about? Yeah, there you go. But anyway. Um, yeah, depending on what I say on the way there, if it's actually important, doesn't need to be included. Or what happens on the way like do i get into any fights do i stumble across a quest i don't know um see at the moment i'm kind of talking about relevance to video structure so i leave it in um but if i was talking about like the old i don't know <laughs> my what i had for dinner then <laughs> i wouldn't put it in the Nobody video but generally i'm usually decide, talking about something a, relative to the video usually i'm not always but uh, or I'm talking about the channel, one of the two. I find something to talk about most of the time, like right now. Realistically, what I'm talking about now isn't useful. It doesn't need to be included, but we're about to get into a fight. So, Watch your feet. if I were to not include this, stink. then I'd we'll be doing that. Wasted. Let's get some cover. And I'm dead. That's just great. Okay, well, that that period on the way here, I will keep. I don't know where it's going to save, honestly, because the, I didn't interact with any doors, but I did complete a quest. Either way, I'll get back to where I was, and I'll cut back to you guys. Okay, we're back. I think for more orders, the encounter weapon I should be utilizing is the assault rifle, so let's use it. That dude just got wasted. Alright, we need to keep an eye out for this high level dude this time around. Minigun did this one. Yeah, I don't know what the hell killed me, honestly. 
Like, there's only three of them. I must have been taking big damage. Anyway, much better. Uh, kind of sad that I died to that, honestly. Um, up on second attempt, that was light work. Absolutely no difficulty at all, provided on the second attempt. So, yeah, that's a failure on my behalf, that's for sure. But, anyway. Yeah, it happens, and we're... We tried again and we succeeded, so... Pulse Hammer. That is better, so I should pick it up, but I just... I don't know, I don't see myself using melee weapons anymore. I did at the start of the game, but now that I've kind of progressed a bit more, I, just, I don't see it. But I may be wrong, I don't know. Either way, what do we got here? Monarch. Cascadia, Fulbrook, Amber Heights, Stellar Bay. Well, I don't even know where I'm going, to be honest with you, but... Kill these dudes, because I don't know not. They all continue to sleep while I was doing that. Hey, it one-tapped. Interesting. Uh, I don't know what the hell this is, but... Righto. Let's check out this area. Either way, a mag pick. Thank you very much. Bypass shunt, bit cartridge, just loot, nothing, nothing special. It doesn't mean I should just ignore it, I suppose. So that's a plasma shotgun, from what I can gather. Also, let's take a drug before we forget, and... Well, we probably already have forgotten for a bit too long, maybe that's why I died. My stats wouldn't uh, lowered when I died, it reset them, I don't know. But, we're about here. We'll do whatever this quest entails, and then that's probably where we'll leave the video off. Um, there's a scrap mechanic there. Nothing too difficult from what I, from my other encounters with this enemy type. We'll see there. There's more than one. Okay, never mind. It's a... Right, okay. I did not realize how close I was. Ringleader down. Look out to the ones that really can hurt you if you let them. Like one snipe from them is a fair bit of damage. But I kept my distance well. Slow time. Someone's still alive, the button. not realize he was hurting me that hard. Good finish for buddy. Alright, there you go. Uh, where did this dude disintegrate into piles of ashes? Good question. Guess we'll never know. What do you got on you? I'll take it. Uh, this guy was like right here. Yeah, he had nothing on him. Fair enough. Alright, what were these fellas protecting? That's the question. That is the question. There seems to be more of them. There seems to be some sort of marauder hideout. Alright, this is Amber Heights. Okay, gotcha. So this is one of our first major settlements for this area. Um, don't know what this is, but seems intriguing in a way. Um, 80 heavy ammo. Keep it coming. I cook on these things? They can't. Alright. Well, whatever's in here, we're about to find out. Let's transition through. This doesn't need to be in the video, so I'll cut it out. I do actually remember this place from my first playthrough. I've been here before. Anyway, let's talk well, to our hello, entry. Well, and welcome to the home of inductor. the iconoclasts. I'm Rose. Please take a pamphlet. In it, you'll find everything you need to know about Graham, his philosophist truths, and the iconoclast way. He wrote it himself, you know. Oh, oh no! I'm so sorry. I keep forgetting. We're out of pamphlets. Gosh, blast it! Um, you're offering me a pamphlet you don't have? I don't want a pamphlet anyway. Uh, who are the... Yeah, I'll ask that. Why, we're the only free people in Halcyon. No corporations, no shackles, no problems. Um, here I thought everyone works for a corporation. I know. It's quite revolutionary. We're a community here. No jobs, no shifts, just people who help each other. You're welcome to stay with us, so long as you can earn your keep. Um... I'm just looking for work. Do you have a boss or a leader? Oh, sure. 
Graham's our founder. He taught us how to cut our own path in the wilderness. And I guess some folk have started following Zora's orders. You can think of those two as our leaders, but they're more like examples. We all ought to be more like them. Um, oh my God, I found him. Graham's place is in the large building straight back. Zora's sometimes there talking with him, but usually she's in the triage clinic next door. Um, why are you here and not in Still Bay? Got it. Hey, before I go, I'm looking for a tucker. Have you seen him? The new boy! Yes, he's quite clever. He took to our teachings very quickly. Last I saw him, he was headed into one of the buildings up the hill. Alright, thank you for that. And with that said, that is where I'm going to call this video. I do not know with edits how long this will be. I may have miscalculated, but I've I've given it about six to seven extra minutes to to acquaint for edited out time so hopefully it's still about half an hour but um yeah we'll leave this here and we'll check out this area this area does have a bit of a quest line to it we'll pursue that in the next episode thank you for checking this one out if you did enough for joining it, please make sure you leave a like drop sub notification bell also make sure to come check out my twitch stream and i'll catch you in the next one peace